it's hard to put a number on it, uh, but, but uh, the recommendations for the uh, pesticide IPMs and all that is very, very valuable to us. Uh, like I said, I can't put an exact number on it, but uh, you know, a lot of times it saves us a lot of money, especially recommendations, because some of us tend to overuse some of the things, and when we get a recommendation that we find that you know less works better. That's always better. Yeah, I, I was going to say we. Pro I probably didn't. We. We don't. I don't actually use the paper publications, but I do go online and and read some of the publications online. Uh, as I've said many times before, you know, I, I always say the vegetable uh, vegetable handbook is the vegetable grower's bible. Uh, you know, it's a real quick resource for finding information on most anything you need to know, or a real good starting point to find information, uh, or a, like I said, a starting point to find whatever information that you need on growing various crops, especially crops that you're not as familiar with. Okay. Very important. It uh, it has reduced our pesticide use to nearly nothing, and uh, we have a, a big beneficial insect population in our fields now. And, and I feel that it's been a big benefit to our farming operation. Access to uh, the IPM. Uh, I've got people uh, from the uh, IPM that comes around and helps me, like Dr. A, and uh, helps me uh, understand uh, the bug, how bugs uh, can ruin your crops, and uh, how to get rid of them, and uh, make a better, just make a better farmer out of me. They've, since I've been in, involved with the IPM project. I have uh, just almost doubled my my money on, that I make on my farm. It's uh, invaluable. Without it, without uh, the research that you do, uh, we're just blind, literally, without it. Akanda mandala karam Yaptam jena chara charam Tat param darshitam jena Tasmai shri guru